Hey, good morning guys. The election is over. We, as in we Americans, have a new president, right? President Donald Trump. The election process, right? Like our reaction to it here in Indonesia was kind of unique because while you guys in America were sleeping, us in Indonesia, right, were able to watch the results roll in live because that was the middle of our day and the middle of your night. And so for us here, right, we just kind of took a break from school and watch the election results and just kind of kept track of, of the progress of each of the candidates, right, Hillary and Trump. And it was interesting to see like New Hampshire, right, flip back and forth between you know, red and blue, red and blue, as it was so close as they were battling that out. And then to watch Florida, right, Florida was kind of one of those key states because it was a close race and they had a lot of uh, electoral votes from there. But to watch that progress and then watch Trump and I take it over and it to go red, uh, go Republican there. And then one of the most kind of um, exciting parts, I guess, was when Pennsylvania, right? I mean, we didn't really expect Pennsylvania to go red, but Pennsylvania even went red. And, um, and so Trump really, I mean, he really won the election. So that was a really fun experience for us being here. And, uh, you know, just looking through the comments and stuff from a lot of our subscribers, uh, mostly from Indonesia, there seems to be maybe um, a lack of understanding between um, like the president and the party and the two different parties, right? The Republican and Democrat. And so what I thought I would do in this video is um, just share some of that information with you to kind of help you better understand, right? And so, first of all, let's just say that there were in the race, right, there were more than two parties. There were other parties as well, but there's two primary parties, the Republicans and the Democrats. Now, the Republicans are also called the right and they're also called conservative. So you have Republican, right, and conservative. And then the Democrats, right, which is Hillary's party, they are also called liberals and the left, right? So you have Democrat, liberal, left, Republican, conservative, right, all right? Those are synonyms that you'll see in different things. And some of the different videos that I'm gonna share with you, we're gonna use those synonyms when they explain different concepts um, and different differences between the two parties. And so just be aware of that. And so there are major differences between the two parties. And so say like for myself, right? I don't necessarily vote for the person, right? Because maybe Trump isn't like the best person to be president, but he represents, in my opinion, the best party to be president, right? The Republican Party and the different principles and philosophies behind the Republican Party, the right or the conservative, right, are the principles and values that, that I share as well. And so um, some people though hold liberal or democratic or left, right, principles and philosophies that they think are more important. And so they would of course vote for Hillary. But really we're voting for the principles and the philosophies behind the person, not necessarily the person themselves, right? The person is less important than the ideology that they are going to propagate as they are president. What was also interesting about this election is not only did the Republicans or conservatives or right get the presidency, but they also have a majority in the Senate and the House of Representatives. And so if they can work together they can accomplish a lot. So maybe you're thinking, what are all of these major differences that you keep talking about? Well, I have got together some excellent videos that will help explain to you the differences. They're actually linked right here. You can go ahead and click on that thumbnail there and it will take you to a playlist that will explain it all to you. So guys, I hope you enjoy watching and I will see you tomorrow.